Now, there has been a very interesting article. You know, I should have sent it to you before the program. But a very interesting article by Ray McGovern, who, as I said, is a former CIA analyst. He used to provide the um, um, daily brief to the president of the United States on behalf of the intelligence community. He is somebody to take extremely seriously indeed. He was, by the way, the CIA analyst in the 1960s who said to the U.S. government at that time that the um, quarrel between the Soviet Union and China was real, that there really was a quarrel going on at that time. And he's been saying for years that the relationship between Russia and China today, that its improvement is also for real. So he's somebody who, you know, you need to listen to. And he's obviously got his connections in Washington. Anyway, what he is now, what he's saying is that in 2021, after Biden was elected president, there was a major effort by the Biden administration, this is before the war in Ukraine, to persuade the Russians to end their relationship with China. And at the summit meeting that took place in Geneva between uh, Putin and Biden was principally about that, that it was an effort by the US to try to get the Russians to distance themselves from China. And Putin and the Russians said, absolutely not, no way. I mean, this isn't even something we're prepared to talk about with you. Our relations with China are our relations with China. They're none of your business. And um, McGovern feels that the subsequent crisis in Russian-US relations was partly caused because of the anger the Americans felt back in 2021 that China, that Russia was refusing to distance itself from China. In mm -hmm. fact, and he, he provides evidence of this, and I can provide more, actually. I mean, I remember articles that were appearing in the American media at the time from all the usual people, uh, well-connected usual people. And that made me think that something had happened. But I think he's crystallizing. And I suspect that he is right. The Americans have been trying to isolate China in all mm -hmm. kinds of ways because they see it as the competitor. They started with Russia in 2021. That failed disastrously. Now they're trying with all sorts of other countries. They succeed from time to time in a few places. The new president of the Philippines uh, a weak man, in my opinion. He's yeah. gone along with it. But uh, I, I gather that Vietnam, in some ways a more significant country, is going in the completely opposite direction. So <laughs> ultimately they're losing. But, um, you know, they're still trying and it still remains their obsession. And I think the Chinese have understood this and figured it out. And as, uh, as you correctly said, I think they cease to care. And I think that with this major relationship with Russia now, uh, solidified, that gives them confidence. And I think that the Chinese will now work on other relationships that matter. Indonesia is an obvious one. India itself, mm -hmm. complicated though that is, probably also with the Indian government also finding the Americans impossible. And of course, Brazil, countries like that.